Hello, this is Ray Snow. So this time, I'm gonna play a game called uh, Veventurer, Altar of Glutes. I'm sorry if my pronunciation is not correct. This is a Kickstarter project, so this is still under development, and the, the developer is currently looking for people to fund this project. And I happened to find out about this game on Twitter. So recently the developers tweeted and said they are currently looking for streamers to play this game, uh, to promote this game. And uh, I watched the trailer and it looked uh, pretty interesting. So I decided to play this and uh, downloaded the, this demo. So what I know is this is a RPG game with a tactical based battle system. On the Kickstarter page, it says Veventure is an eclectic fusion of Western, Japanese, and strategy RPGs with stunning 3D visuals and challenging tactical combat. Mm. Uh, sounds really nice. So let's uh, play this new game. The graphic is pretty beautiful. Kind of reminds me of Oblivion. I do want to apologize for our last meeting, Bodom. Some mushroom is walking. While I know you don't recall the first time you were here, I must point out that the Atonian Steppe is quite a dangerous place, even for the conscious. Conscious. Oh. Judging from your spider slashing skills, however, I neglect to think that we'll be in any real danger, but it bears repeating that we should remain vigilant. Are you done yet? I really don't want to spend all day out here. The beach is just ahead, and I'd like to be back before all the mutton's gone. I know you're a busy man, Apris, but I hope you've carved out a few minutes to have a look at Atonia, you know, while we're here. I have no interest in that old church. The only thing that matters to me is that his story checks out. And what happens if, he, if it doesn't check out? I imagine you and I will be a little late getting back for dinner. No need for threats. I'll show you exactly where I came ashore, where I was when I saw the pulse. Forget the damn pulse. It's common knowledge that the uh, place is cost. You can ask anymore. I don't know what it is with the two of you, but we wisps don't intrigue me all that much. This wasn't an ordinary wisp, a police, but either way, you are afraid of ghosts, I get it. Even our guest get, gets it. Guest, so guest means us, maybe? Before we set off, I want to add that there is a hunter's camp on the other side of the river. We can rest and restock if need be. We can cross the river using the bridge, or perhaps uh, Vilum, Vilum, I don't know how to tr how pronounce this, Vilum would ferry us across. Since when is there a bridge? Who authorized the bridge? Now, now, let's not spend all day out here. Onward to Atonia. Hmm. Okay, uh, access the main menu by pressing the tab or I keys. To see the full list of controls, press space to open the configuration panel. Okay. Uh, tab. Ah, okay. Inventory equipment skills. 
HP SP Experience EP. What is this EP? AP. Skills. Ah, oh, okay. So this is like a skill tree. Backstop. Slash. Hmm. Deal five percent bonus damage, but take ten percent extra damage. Sounds like a passive skill. Increases move by five. Hmm. Run equip EP. Equipment. Rusty daggers. A uh, weapon, helmet, chest, gauntlets, boots, accessory, relic. Inventory. So, panacea. Well, springs absorbent. Wow, a lot of categories. Uh, all items, usable weapon, armor, accessories, relics, resource, key item. Hmm, okay, uh, let's explore, I, I think. So, okay, so you can rotate the camera with your mouse. You can choose a graphic option when you uh, start the game and uh, my PC's graphic power is not that strong so I chose the lowest setting so I think there was uh, four choices and I, I chose the lowest one. Okay so... So can we fight these monsters? And I mean where... Should I be going? Okay, uh, let me check the control. Ah, okay, so I, I can use gamepad as well. Okay, maybe I'm gonna use gamepad then. Combat, choose options, cancel, confirm, move, camera rotate, okay. Ah, okay, this is better. So you cannot jump, I think, I guess. Hello, hello mushroom. Are you an enemy or you don't look hostile? Can I sprint? I wonder. And where... Oh, maybe we need to go to this place? I cannot jump. Hmm. Oh, okay. Ah, that, that's a bridge. Oh, what? Oh, okay. Ah, so it works like this. So when you encounter enemy, then uh, so you enter this battle battle screen. Uh, you prove yourself well at Atonia, but if you want, I can give you a few more combat tips. This will be a little. Lengthy, so bear with me. Listen to Morok's tips. Uh, sure, why not? To your right, all combatants are sorted by their SPD attribute. SPD. Speed? Faster characters act sooner and can even overtake others. You're pretty nimble, so it's likely you'll act first most of the time. As such, you are at the very top of the list. You mean, I'm the... I'm this bottom? Okay. Ah, okay, I see. Ah, okay, so we can see the enemy too. Enemies too. Mm -hmm. 
Each character has access to four options, but the acting characters can also move freely at any time during his or her turn. You can move within the blue circle using the WSD key or the controller's left joystick. The distance that the character can move is based on their move attribute. Mm. So about those four options, the first one is attack. When you hover over this option, a red circle will appear and you can attack any enemy within that circle. This size of this circle is determined by the RNG attribute of that particular weapon. Since you fight with daggers, your range is pretty limited. But then again, so is mine. The next option is items. This will allow you to select and use an item from your inventory. Like attacking, you can use it on any ally within the green circle. There is also end turn, which is pretty self-explanatory. In general though, your turn will end naturally once you have moved and or performed an action. Which brings us to the last action, skills. Skills vary wildly in their ranges, target types and capabilities. But they also possess two unique characteristics. The first of these is the SP cost and this appears as a number in the top right corner of the skill icon. Uh, so many things to <laughs> memorize. And this, uh, uh, in general, most skills cost some amount of SP to use. Okay. Mm skill point. The second of these is the charge. Uh, typically, a skill won't execute on the same turn you selected and will require some number of turns before it executes. Mm, okay. The charge value is represented by a ring of blue orbs that surround the skill icon. Since skills can take a while to charge, you should take care that the intended target will be in range of the skill once it executes. For that reason, you'll want to keep a close eye on the turn order. When you highlight or select a skill, the turn order will update to show when that particular skill will execute. When you queue up a skill, your turn will end, so think about that while moving. When attacking or using an item, however, you can move first or continue moving afterwards. The cool thing is that you can check the range and the targets of any skill while you are moving around simply by highlighting that skill. It's pretty useful. We are almost done, but this last part is important, so pay attention. When multiple skills are queued up in succession, it initiate the chain. While a chain is active, each skill that executes against a target will deal increasingly higher damage. It doesn't matter whether the successive skills are ally or enemy, so use this to your advantage by trying to queue up skills against the same target for bonus damage. When a target is hit by a chained skill and takes extra damage, one or more ex exclamation marks will appear after the damage text. Oh yeah, and you can inspect any combatant by pressing bracket or using the left or right bumpers or by clicking on one of the turn order panels directly. This will let you see if you are in range of an enemy skill or if an enemy has moved out of your own skill range as well as any uh, status effects that may be applied. I know we covered a lot, but that should about do it. I'm ready whenever you are, okay. I don't think I understand everything, but yeah, let's see. Begin the battle, let's do it. Yeah, let's do it. Uh, okay. Uh, uh -huh. Ah, okay, so we can move. And so if, if if you move, like you use some moving point or something. 
Okay, let's try to attack. How to attack it? Oh, so now I can attack it? Drone. 20 damage. And now it's drone's turn. Mm -hmm. Okay. So now Morok. So he's like a. Monk. So he he fights with bare hands, it seems. Okay. Attack again. Hmm. And end the turn. What about Apolis? Okay, Apolis. And he's like a fighter type. Ah, okay, so this red circle is the attack range, I think. So if you if the enemy enter this red circle, then uh, you can attack. It seems. So now we can select. Okay, let's attack drone one. And this guy is like a assassin, assassin type. Okay, attack drone one. The attacking effect feels kind of simple. Hmm. Now what? Okay. So. Ah, okay. So this is the. You cannot go out of this blue circle. So this is uh, this is the, your like a moving moving range. Okay. Hmm. We won. Experience obtained. A shiny tool. Okay. Some like uh, ingredients or something. Okay. Ah. Uh, I think I should heal because bottom has only 41. Anybody can use like a healing magic? Mm, backstab. No, yeah, I think he's a assassin kind of character. Okay. Maybe Moloch can heal. Punch chakra restore minor HP. Ah, okay, this one. Can I use this? Hmm? No, unequip. No, how to use this? Uh, hmm? I want to use this skill. Unequip upgrade run. No, 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 no. How to use this? Wait, 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 wait. How to use this? Uh, invent, invent, inventory, no. Wait. Maybe you can, you can use skills only during the combat. There is no use option. Hmm. Okay. I, I don't know. So let's use this one, I guess. Then. Uh, bottom. Okay. So, mm, okay. We cannot jump off the cliff. Uh, 
Ah, okay, so we can zoom in and zoom out. Oh, what is that? Hmm, how to go down? Maybe this way. Attack me, please. So, can I uh, see the full map? Not mini map. What is this? Oh, okay. Oh, what is this? I'm not sure. And what is this? Oh, this is status. Okay. Hmm. Ah, minimap is gone. Oh, oh. Wait, 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 wait. How to M? Ah, okay. Don't attack me. Don't attack me. Run. <laughs> okay. Oh, there is a signboard. Can I check? Beach Hunter's Camp Sefa Sefarin. Okay, I don't remember, but uh, maybe we should go to this Hunter's Camp. It's our destination, maybe? Oh! Hmm. Okay. Uh, so I cannot attack this on this turn. So maybe we should wait for the enemies to approach around here. Hmm? How to? Ah, okay. Ah. Yeah, let's end the turn. Oh, and but bottom is an um, assassin, so maybe hmm. yeah, let's use some skills. So skill what? taunt and uh, rajum deals moderate physical damage to a nearby enemy. Ah, so, ah, okay, so it needs time to charge. Okay, so let's try to backstab. So, mm, okay. Let's uh, wait here. And so, what can you do? Chakra, list of minor HP, and gut punch. Lower the nearby enemy's resistance and deals minor physical damage. Hmm. Okay. Oh. Oh. <laughs> so that skill was activated instantly. Okay. Uh, let's try to backstab him. Like from here. I don't know which is which direction he is facing. Okay, skill, slash, and backstab. Stab some enemy, dealing moderate physical damage. Deals more damage when behind the target. So I'm behind the target. I'm not sure. <laughs> Let's try. And, okay. Uh, attack. Uh, 
attacks. Mm. Oh, 31 damage. Mm. Okay. Alright. Oh, there is a some strong looking monster over there. Is this the right way to go? Uh, maybe not. Hmm. Ah, okay, but maybe this is the bridge. So, okay, let's go straight then. is that we have to fight this guy no okay uh huh hmm there was some indication about uh, our destination oh okay so we can see some icons here so maybe this is a village or a town oh is that a human I think okay I think we arrived in a village or something Hello, what a strange trope to see this far out. Not that there is much to see. I can tell you need to rest and as luck would have it, most hunters are out for a few days. Stay for uh, 80 pol? Uh, she's right, I could rest a bit. Uh, okay, not now. Fair enough, I offered and that's all I can do. Okay. Oh, so this is the inn. Ah, okay, I see. What is this? Ah, okay, candle. She looks kind of scary. <laughs> Look, this looks like a ruin, but uh, okay, so they created a village uh, on the ruin, maybe. What is this? What is this? Save crystal. Ah, okay. So, it, ah, so you can save here. Hmm. And targeting dummy. Can, can I attack? Oh, wait, wait. What brings you a bunch of softies south of the river? Looking to make a purchase? I've heard good things about the hunter's market, but I must say that I'm disappointed. Nothing illicit at all. Whoa, ah, uh, I don't know what you've heard, but you can't just come in here, making those types of accusations. We know how this works. We scratch your, your back and you scratch ours. What do you need for us to see your real wares? Alright then, big man. Larson hasn't been able to keep up with our iron ore demand. Bring me 20 chunks of iron, and we'll talk. Very well. We'll just stick to your pity words until then. 
I'll sell you my best if you bring me 20 iron ore. Huh? Okay, so it's like a quest. How about look at the normal goods then? Uh, okay. Car chase. Mm -hmm. So I am ah, okay. So he's selling weapon as well. Weapon and uh, armor. Okay. Not now, I think. So that's everything in this town. Hmm. Okay. I think that's everything. Yeah, save point and uh, shop and uh, yeah, bet in. Hmm. I'm not sure. Maybe I I wasn't reading the conversation carefully, but I have no idea where to go. I think they are talking about wisp, but I I have no idea where where we should go so our objective is to kill the wisps is there like a quest log or something bestiary tactics data what is this data ah okay this is a save save data mm, inventory so there is no quest log it seems. Hmm, okay. Okay, let's explore a little bit more. Whoa, what's that? Whoa, whoa. He's running to us or he's just running? Okay. Oh, he, is he sleeping? And Looks like, yeah, okay, we can take this. Can I move this map? No, I cannot. Okay, ah, uh, and uh, so also they are talking about this boat. So, you, like uh, he said, if you want to cross the river, then you should ask be bedroom or something. Hmm. Hello. So they are not aggro, it seems. Then uh, I think I'm gonna... I'm gonna try to go to this point. So I think this is where we can ride a boat. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, okay. Is anybody here? No one? Can, can we enter? And... Uh, oh! There is someone, I think. he's fishing hello so this guy is uh, I don't know how to pronounce this B Bilum. looks like your friend is feeling better Morok couldn't even walk last I saw saw him so that did you Morok insisted there were no witnesses telling the truth was I'm a lot of things but a witness ain't one of them. Uh, I was glad to help, no questions asked. Not only did you not help me as I was carted away unconscious, but you were willing accessory. How heroic of you. And there you are, safe and walking boy, so quit your ve I'm sorry, I, I, I'm really bad at reading this kind of 
uh, speaking style. I've seen way worse fates before the enemies of the syndicate. Now I know you didn't come all the way out here just to chat. What it be then? Need a ride downstream? Helpful as always, Berum. Thanks, and of course you'll be paid well for your time. Where are you going? Oh, okay, Hunter's Camp Ruined Dock? Hunter Camp? So Hunter Camp is the village we went to earlier. I'm not so sure. Uh, um, ruined Dock? Okay. I have no idea where this is, but uh, okay, I think uh, I'm gonna try to go to Hunter Camp first. Oh, what? Oh, are we teleported to this point by boat for some reason? But there is no water around here, though. But I uh, saw, so, yeah, this is the hunter's camp, okay. So this uh, place, ah, okay, then, then I should have choose the other one. Ruined something, okay. I'm back here. Okay, but probably I think I'm guessing maybe the other option if we uh, if we choose the other option, then uh, it will take us to the uh, starting point. So I'm not sure, but uh, I think I'm gonna check this arrow. So yeah, it's indicating like we should go this way or something. I think so. Mm, let's check this arrow. Oh no 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 no. Don't mind me. So something's gonna happen if we reach here. Oh 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 Loading. Oh okay, so we uh we enter a new area, I think. Oh, okay. So I can see save point icons and uh, looks like a church or something. That one is. Okay, let's check that church. What? Oh, iron ore. Oh, okay. This is a big stone though. Received iron times two. Oh, okay, and it disappears. Uh, which way? What is this? Ooh. Oh, there's a... Oh, uh, okay, this is the one maybe? I think. Sure, you don't want to join us? I'll have a look around out here. Hurry up. What? What is this place exactly? When the Kel Kelva Kelvari first appeared, a handful of different groups sprang up in response. The Atonians were one such group, more like a sect, really. They believed that the Kelvari exist to punish us for our, how did they put it, limitless iniquity. A lot of people believed that, actually, but the Atonians took it further. They thought they could uh, placate the loot if they were to atone for whatever sins they thought we committed. 
but the Kilvari are still here and the Atonians aren't. What happened to them? They screamed their beliefs a bit too loudly, attracted the wrong kind of attention, as it were. If there is one thing that set a Westerner off, it's being told what to do. As for what this shrine is, no one is entirely sure, nor are they really even curious. Most of what the Atonians did here on the step remains a mystery. I'd say the prospect of ghosts tends to shut down curio curiosity. Apolis is delusional. There isn't such a thing as ghosts, or at least in the way that he thinks but he isn't alone in his beliefs, which is why no one ever investigates the wisps. I know the Atonian steppe very well, its inhabitants, its nooks and crannies. You could even say that I run the steppe. Owing to my position, if these flashes of light did exist, I'd know about them. Not to say I haven't heard stories, but they are often from less than reputable men. So it was quite a shock to see it yesterday. It was far more intense than I'd heard described and I have no doubt it would have proven fatal at the right distance. I hate to cut you off, but I don't even know if my companions are alive at this point. There is clearly nothing here, so let's move on. As you wish. Hmm. Hey, Bodom. I hope you are being truthful about all of this. As you may have surprised, uh, surmi surmised, Apolis is considerably less open-minded than news truly. Good news, Apolis. We put all the spirits to rest. Hilarious. While you were bloviating blo in there, what does this mean? I actually did find something. Where? What is it? If you look closely, there appears to be something strewn about the shore. A person? Looks like flotsam to me. Hard to tell if someone's down there until we get closer. Uh-huh. I have no idea what you are talking about. I don't see anything. All those chemicals have ruined your eyesight. Is that where you came ashore, bottom? No, it was further down. At any rate, looks like he wasn't being facetious after all. Facetious? I don't, I'm, I'm not so sure about the pronunciation. We'll see about that. It could be any number of things, an Ovanian vessel, even. Uh, okay, so we need to check the flotsam. Where is it, though? Uh, I'm not sure. Ah, no, 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 don't come, please. Mm, so, destination is... I have no idea. Is there anything here? What is this? Oh, 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 oh what is this? Oh, monster? But it looks like a... like a robot? Wow, what is this? Insect, robot, like something. Oh, mushroom. Uh, 
スマグラーズキャップ。OK、Let's、uh, try to fight this robot, robot like monster. Hey man, hello? I think what? Where are we now? I thought we are in a cave. And there are two of them, and another fish like monster as well. Wow, I think we're gonna die. <laughs> okay, let's attack this guy then. So you can heal everyone in the, in the, in the range. That's nice. Oops. No. Restore minor HP to arise near Molo. Not much, I think. Okay. Wow. Damn, he's gonna die. Bottom is gonna die. What is he doing? This guy. Okay. Okay, let's use chakra again. Ah, uh, no, don't attack, please. Not yet. Dead. Dead. So, can we escape from the battle? I mean, there is no way we can win this battle. So, wait, 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 wait. How, how can we escape? Is there a way to escape from the battle? Uh, No, don't. Mm. I don't know. So, hmm, there is no way to escape from the battle. Because、mm. there is no run option. I cannot go any further. Yeah, I cannot go any further.、Mm, so, probably there is no way to escape from the battle.、Mm, chakra. Or maybe I'm gonna use item. 25 SP. Removes all negative status effect. Restore all HP and the target ally. Revive target ally.、Oh, okay, this is good. But first, I'm gonna use this and heal Morok. I think I'm gonna revive. But I, I cannot use this. Why? Oh, 
I think uh, you have to go, uh, you have to stand next to the body to revive him. I think. Ah, okay. Yes, okay. Maybe we can win this battle. <laughs> We have some potions, so if we use potion 7, only 7. Wow! 76? No way. Attack. Three damage. Come on. Almost thirty one. Die. No? Oh, yes. Okay, we killed it. Only this guy left. Okay, maybe we can win this battle. Wow! Oh, he's he's still alive. He's still alive. Two. Okay. Uh, let's use this healing. Oh no. Okay. Let's use this. Wellspring sap. Re restore all HP and SP. HP Okay, almost Okay, finally Oh, and the level up Level 2 HP plus 16 mm, Okay Whew. That was a tough oh, And we are back in the cave Hmm Hmm, so where to go? Where's the flotsam? I have no idea. Okay, we can see the ocean. Hmm, maybe this is the way to go. No, 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 no. Don't. Oh, what is that? Looks dangerous. Ah, oh, what? There is nothing here? What? Really? Okay. So, where is that flotsam? Check this canyon. Oh, but I cannot go any further. Looks like a cave, though. Okay, so we cannot go this way. Hmm, then I have no idea where to go. Uh, yeah. I don't know. Okay, I think I'm gonna stop this here for now. I walked around for a while, but I couldn't find the next destination. So, I don't know. Maybe it is still not implement implemented in this build, or 
I'm not sure. Maybe I, I just couldn't find it. I think the graphic the graphics of this game is pretty good, considering this is an indie game and uh, developed by a small team. So I think uh, the graphic is pretty impressive. And uh, as I said earlier, uh, I played this with the uh, lowest graphics setting, so this can be better than this if you have a better PC. And uh, the battle system is... Uh, I have a mixed feeling. I think I, I've got used to fight directly in this kind of open world RPG, so at first it felt a bit strange. The screen switch to other battle screens. I felt like, oh, let me attack directly. But uh, after a while, I got used to this battle and uh, I started enjoying it. Although I don't think, uh, you know, I I understand the all about this battle system. Maybe it will get more interesting if you continue to play. Story-wise, I cannot say it's interesting or not at this point because we only saw a couple of dialogues and uh, it, didn't, it didn't tell us much about the story. Yeah, so they have created this world and uh, you can see monsters. Some monsters are running around or sleeping and so it made me feel, you know, they, the developers have paid uh, attention to the details. But on the other hand, you know, you don't see much NPC in this world, so there's not many people to talk. The world feels kind of vacant. Not much event is happening, it seems. I don't know, maybe I just couldn't find them, but I'm not sure. But uh, mm. So I hope they're gonna add a lot more content to this world, like NPC or village. Mm. Also, what I... What I thought is I wish uh, they they gonna add more indications about quest like a quest log or uh, like even even if you open the map there is no indication about these icons so you have no idea you know what this means and uh, also you have no no idea where to go so I hope they they're gonna improve these parts as well and uh, during the battle. I felt the like attacking effect or skill effect is kind of weak so you can hear a sound but it's kind of very small sound you know when they attack monsters and uh, it doesn't give you much satisfaction of attacking or killing enemies so I hope they're gonna improve this one as well yeah I felt like uh, this build is still quite rough so there are many rooms to improve and uh, I think it's only natural because this is still uh, under development so I know a lot of games it looks really bad uh, you know at the earlier, earlier stage but uh, you know becomes much much better at the later stage so I'm sure this game will be will be better than this so I wish good luck on the development as I said at the beginning of this video so this is a Kickstarter project and uh, they are looking for backers and uh, they pledged of $50,000 and uh, uh, so far they have collected about $15,000 mm. so about 30% less than 30% and the Kickstarter will end in March 1st. So, yeah, about half a month to go. Yeah, so if you're interested in this game, please visit the Kickstarter page and the bucket if you want. Anyway, that's it for now, and thank you very much for watching, and see you again. Bye. Oh, what is this? Wait, 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 wait. What is this shadow? Hmm? Oh, a dragon is flying.